with this strategy, you'll always be with money, even if you have just a few dollars to start with. Watch this video attentively and earn today already. Hello, my dear friends. Today we're trading on mobile phone as I understand that most of you don't have an opportunity to trade in work hours, spending time by computer or laptop. So most of you use smartphones. Well, there is nothing complicated about it, but it's one thing when you're using your phone to open a deal on a signal, it's easy, you just need to choose the currency pair, the time, uh, 15 minutes, usual one and direction of the deal. It's really simple and you don't need more than your phone for that. But it's another thing when you're trying to make full analytics, when you're trying to trade from your mobile app. I don't say it's impossible or wrong, actually it's possible, but uh, you know some knowledge are required and you also need the strategy enough to trade from your phone. The feature of trading from your phone is that it's much harder to see uh, the global things happening on the market and using some little indicators, uh, little data is very convenient, it's not very convenient. So today we're using two indicators, I mean it's uh, one indicator but we add it twice, moving average indicator or MA. Uh, the first indicator's line has 12 as a period, okay, we change nothing here, and the second line has 25 as a period, we'll make it thicker, so for example 2-3 pixel and the color is red. Okay, great, we added trend indicator, it doesn't take a lot of space, but at the same time it provides a lot of information which we can use in our trading. And what do we know about moving average indicator? Firstly, indicator has two different periods, it has intersections, which are some kinds of signals uh, of the trends change from upward to downward or from downward to upward. So when the green line is below the red one, it means the market is in a downtrend. When conversely the green line is above the red one, it means the uptrend prevails. So today's goal is trading on a trend and all of the deals follow the trend. The only nuance is that we're looking for an entry point. Well, we can use both red and green indicators as support or resistance lines as these are pretty popular periods and a lot of traders use them. Moreover, we can use intersections of 2MI uh, as a signal. So if the green line intersects the red one from uh, top to bottom, it is a signal to go lower. If the line intersects the red one from bottom to top, it is a signal with higher and be sure to pay attention how the signal used to work out earlier. For example, right now the signal comes, maybe it worked out already, but what do we do is watching the trends change coming and here we broke the red line through as you can see. Then we lowered to this red line on another retest and after that the growth was started again. This is a good signal to keep uptrend. Based on all of the patterns, we conclude it's a good opportunity right now to enter the market with higher. We don't hesitate and just click buy button. Today we'll try to make the deposit at least two times bigger. And I'm curious will we manage to do it or not. Anyway, I'll be satisfied with any earnings because even for me, trading from mobile phone is just something new. The whole trading process is being preceded on 1 minute time frame. The time of the deal is 1 minute and the time of the candle is 1 minute as well. Uh, okay, we're, today we're making analytics on the same time frame as the time of the deal. The first deal is closed on a profit, so we're looking for the second deal on similar scenario. So guys, here's another intersection. This time the green line intersects the red one from top to bottom. It dives below the red one, in other words, and it means downtrend continuation. The only thing that confuses me is that we can draw a horizontal line here and will not a support level. Anyway, we can get a reaction from this level and what matters is having enough time for the deal to be closed in a profit. 
In general, the case looks pretty good. Well, we had an attempt of a uh, break here, so it was an attempt of upward motion, but as we see, we still dive below the red line. It means the seller is pushing the market really hard and the downtrend remains. It's a dangerous moment right now, it would be perfect to have time to be closed, but I don't know whether we'll have time or not. If we don't, we unfortunately roll back from support line, uh, then we'll place two more deals. I think they'll bring us a profit this time, they have to. Well, if we were located a little farther from uh, the, this area, which is holding the fall back, then we would earn on the first deal already with no problem. So as you can see, Martin Gale's strategy pays off. The series of three deals is closed in a profit and we earn. Here we still get a reaction from support zone. So let's find another case and switch to it. So guys, we open another deal. It might be a good signal here as after the trends change, um, by the way, the phase of uptrends is active on the market and we touch the quick moving average. We're doing it right now. Well, um, it's not that there might be some reversal mid and uptrends continuation, but we can at least um, get a reaction. So here it would be more rational to open a deal for 30 seconds, uh, but we hope one minute deal will bring us result as well. It seems some green candle of pretty good size is being formed, so in a few seconds it will finish its formation and will manage to get our profit. So it's great, as I've already said, it's better to open short deals for a reaction. Literally 20-30 seconds is enough if you enter a deal on a touch with this line. Well, now we'll be likely moving to the main red line and maybe we'll keep our upward movement on the reaction from the red line. So we're getting ready for opening another deal. The candle seems to finish its formation uh, and two lines will intersect. Great, the lines intersect. Uh, the green one intersects the red one from um, top to bottom. And it means the change from uptrend to downtrend is happening. So we take um, vertical line, mark entry point, and we can check uh, which signal we can <clears throat> we had for the previous time. Well, it worked out not so great, but we hope this deal will work out good. Well, previously we had some flat motion. And let me remind you, it's around the trade on a trend indicator when there's a flat on the market or sideways motion. As you can see, there are a lot of intersections, but there is no point in them. So we need to look for only those cases when a clear trend change is happening from upward to downward or vice versa. So these are those cases when the market's been below two moving average for a long time and then it intersects them. In this moment, the signals are very good and we can safely enter the market. Well, it seems there's another intersection, we can enter the market, but look, there is no case similar to trends change. All of that looks like one sideways motion, so in this case, I won't risk and open deals. So here's my tip, avoid such cases. So guys, some interesting uptrend is coming, so on a small retracement, I open a deal with higher for one minute. If we look at the chart's earlier part, we'll see it's been moving really good recently. So it's moving in wave shape and one line is intersecting the another one slowly, which is why the trend changes. So right now I think it's more than a good deal. Summarizing this video's result, what can we say? We managed to make the deposit more than two times bigger already and it pleases me a lot. As we were trading from mobile, I can say that those conditions make everything harder than trading from a computer. So, as you can see on my simple example, spending just 10-15 times on trading, you can make your deposit 100% and more bigger even by yourself. 
and if you want some easier way of earnings then i recommend you trading uh, from your phone on professional signals so you don't make a lot of mistakes as your trading possibilities are limited the link to my signals is below this video so subscribe and don't forget to share this video with your friends and don't say goodbye for long we'll meet really soon in my next video bye bye